Hey guys, we're in Ephesians chapter 4 today and the Apostle Paul is writing here and he's talking about the, the gifts that are given to the church. And listen to this, Ephesians 4 beginning in verse 11. And he gave the apostles and the prophets and the evangelists and the shepherd teachers to equip the saints for the work of the ministry for building up the body of Christ. So notice what he says there. We have apostles and evangelists and pastor teachers and we have these different ones and they are given to the church but then they have a job to do. And it's to equip the saints. And who are the saints? Well, that's everyone who are, that are believers, all those who are believers in Jesus. They are saints. They're not saints because they're really good people, but because they've been given the righteousness of Christ. And so if you're a follower of Jesus, then you're a saint. So you can say, I'm St. Joe or St. Mary, whatever you are, because of the righteousness of Christ. And so their job is to equip the saints to do the work of the ministry. And sometimes in churches we have this idea that, oh, the pastors or maybe the elders, if you have those in your church, oh, well, they're supposed to do the ministry and I just come and get fed and, and just uh, show up and I give my tithe and things like that. Well, that's not the way the church is supposed to work. The church is supposed to work is we're a body of believers and we each are part of that body and we have different functions and different giftings. And the job of the, the pastor teachers and those are to equip the saints meaning all believers, for the work of the ministry. Now listen to what it says. How, how long do we do this for? Verse 13. Until we all attain to the unity of faith and of the knowledge of the Son of God to mature manhood to the measure of the stature of the fullness of Christ. Now, so how long are we going to do this? Well, until everybody in the church is mature in Christ. Everybody. But the thing is, we're always adding new people as we share the gospel and they come to faith. So how long are we to do this, this, this pattern of equipping the saints and the saints doing the ministry? until Jesus comes back. Are you in a church? Are you part of those saints being equipped to do the work of the ministry? I hope you are. Have a good day.